A great number of people have been taught that in order to remove those pesky sticky labels from Ankara fabrics, all you need is a piece of cloth or a paper towel and a pressing iron. The heat from the iron helps to remove those sticky labels from your fabrics without leaving any residue. But what happens to a person who totally forgot to remove the labels before washing their fabrics? You know, you have to prep your fabrics before you get on with any creations. Don't worry, I've got you covered. In this video, we're going to look at how to remove labels from fabrics that have been washed with labels on them. So, as you probably can see now, I am going to be changing over to the no steam option on my pressing iron because of the, the sticky label got quite degenerated um, during the washing process. So I decided to go without steam and um, I got quite frustrated. So the lesson is you need a lot of patience in order to remove these labels from your fabric. So the idea is to just um, put your cloth or your paper towel over the label and um, apply heat, remove, apply heat, remove. That's what you're just gonna have to keep go going back and forth, back and forth until you remove it. So those um, labels that have been quite <laughs> damaged by the washing process require no steam. And then those that have their labels a little bit intact would require a bit more steam. So yeah, so patience and steam or no steam. Just play around with the steam setting on your iron and um, just take it from there. But in the end, you will be able to remove those labels. All you need is patience. <laughs> this next label is slightly more intact and that's the reason why you can see a bit of steam coming out from the iron because I switched over to the steam setting um, and you can see the ease. <laughs> it's a, I just don't understand how this thing works, but I just had to um, learn from my mistakes and I thought I must share this with you because I'm sure you know we're not perfect lots of us make mistakes and um, these mistakes can be solved so you can see that I kept um, going back and forth with the paper towel over the you know that area with the residue on it because I just wanted to make sure that all the glue from the sticky labels were transferred over to the paper towel. Feel free to um, use new paper towels for different sections so you will not transfer the glue onto the fabric, if that makes sense. Okay, so now that you've seen how to remove these labels from your African wax fabric, the next thing for you to do is have a look at these videos I have here on the screen, showing you a few tips, tricks, and inspiration. And I hope to see you over at those videos and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. All the very best, bye.